So I suppose it's demo day? I don't know, something alliterative. Um, but I wanted to show this off. I have an ever-evolving need to keep track of all the things I'm doing. Writing, videos, other projects, actual life stuff. I hate spending a bunch of time figuring out where I'm at and what I need. I want to do it once and do it right and move forward. And that's what this is about. I've experimented with a few project and work managers like uh, Jira and Trello and Monday.com and, and they're all good uh, for particular things. Uh, they don't do the things I need them to do. So let me start with what I needed and show you how I got to where I got. I need a place that works for me. It doesn't have to be collaborative. It just has to keep me on track. I need to know what stage any given project is at. I need to know what deadlines are coming up and I need to be able to keep my work life and my home life separate. And I need it to all be in one place. So here we are. I've got a separate view for blog posts and videos, and they outline each step in the process. I cribbed a bunch of these steps and stages from a, uh, an incredible video by Karen Cabot, which is in the show notes. And having them here encourages me not to skip steps, right? It's really easy to get lazy or to take a shortcut and I don't like that. The columns change color to let me know what stage each item is at and the deadlines change color when they loom closer or pass. I filter out completed items by filtering on the last cell uh, but they're always here so I can walk back through old deadlines and I can also make sure I never repeat myself. The project view gives me easy visibility into what I'm working on right now. The latest deadlines in each section are pulled in. I can see what stage they're at. When I sit down to work on a thing, sometimes it only needs five minutes of attention. Sometimes it needs an hour, but either way, I can work to push those colors to the right. And that's how I sort of know that I'm making progress, right? Did I push a thing here or not? The work view does the same thing, uh, but it's for work. Finally, the idea sheet. Uh, this is just notes and dates. If I have a weird idea, I have a couple of if this then that scripts, uh, just little triggers uh, where I can text things, I can do it from my phone, uh, I can email things, and they all wind up here in the spreadsheet. It's designed to take weird thoughts and one-off ideas and things that I have and store them in a single place where I can turn them into blog posts or projects or put them off for later or just reject them and leave them behind. I've been using this for about six months now. And it's been doing more than help me stay on track. It does a lot to relieve my worries and anxieties, right? I have an, an, a desire to like fiddle with things or I think about, oh, where am I in comparison to this? Where am I on that? And keeping it here means I checked it and it's done. I know exactly where I am. I just sort of come here and look. And I go, okay, is there something on here that I can just take care of really quickly? Or do I want to schedule some time to deal with it? This sample is available in the links below. Feel free to make your own copy, add additional variations to make it work for you, and let me know what changes you make in the comments. Right? I'm always looking for ways to improve it. Keep on top of your stuff and stay awesome.